In early March 2014, a girl just under two years of age was playing with her siblings in an upstairs bedroom while her mother was making dinner downstairs. Reportedly, the top drawer of a dresser had been left open. She was playing in the room with her sisters and brothers, and my da one of my daughters took off to want to go to take a shower. The other ones left the room for like no more than two minutes, and she tried to climb on top of the dresser. And when she did that, the dresser fell on top of her. And I heard the noise, I went upstairs right away, and you, I found her laying on the floor with the TV on top of her head. She was bleeding. That's when I called, well, I went to the neighbors, they called, we called 911, and then I called him after it happened. At the moment of the scream, from the way my wife explained to me, she was up there, TV off of her, my daughter in her hands, and downstairs in about a minute. The child was rushed by ambulance to a hospital and was found to have facial injuries and multiple skull fractures in the back and front of the head. Medical personnel told family that the child could have easily been killed by the impact of the heavy TV, considering the child's age and size. The next day, she was admitted to the pediatric intensive care unit. She was diagnosed with fractures of the right occipital bone and adjacent pneumocephalus and six other facial and skull fractures. There were no neck or spinal injuries. The child was transferred to Children's Hospital in Philadelphia for specialized surgery on her ear canal. She was discharged to home after CHOP determined no need for surgeries for ENT, for neurology issues, or for plastic surgery. The girl experienced hearing loss that was diagnosed in her right ear and felt to be the result of dried blood. Within a week, she was just pretty much the way she is now, except with just a little bit of bruising, you know, slightly. There's no longer a TV in that room. Um, the dresser, next time I will make sure that there's a strap on there Keep drawers where they're not overstuffed, so that they don't stick out. Make sure that if you have a dresser, it's on a steady, on a steady place, level floor, or strap it to the wall. Doesn't take much to screw it in. It'll, it'll save the drama, and it'll save an accident and a child. 